Oh, why did I heal himself? Shoot, I should have healed there. Sue. That's fine. Sue will just have to carry us with her healing. Love that ability. <laughs> so good. Oh, holy shit. The damage. With defense up, I might add. That would be hard to do. It's a lot of stuff going on in a small little emo. When will, when will Sanren Kagura games go on the writing that list? Oh! Never. Now you'll be okay. <laughs> Listen, we we failed we failed to get the uh, the the KFC dating sim in. All right. If we can't even get that that to to get in, then you know, why would I do Sanren Kagura? These are pretty rough. Now you'll be okay. <laughs> You're on her side to make all the Moogle emotes. Well, I do have some new emotes commissioned from her, but I don't think I've, any of them are Moogle emotes, though. That is a good idea, to be honest, Kim. I like the idea a lot. That was close. Well, a lot of people have come and gone. A lot of good friends, a lot of good people. Just the way it is. I wonder if I get star ups for it. You know, I get level up, but do I get star up? But it doesn't it doesn't show the stars for heal. So I don't think it actually does star up, it just levels up. Yeah, that, that, and she's just very busy all the time. Oh, um, rip. Anybody down there? And all that, that bird that just got smashed by all those boulders. Okay. That's some fancy technology making blocks appear out of nowhere. I like how this part of the end of the world looks like it just didn't f finish being constructed or it's more weathered than any other part. I, I'm going back. We've climbed and climbed and we still haven't reached the top. Puff puff. What's wrong, Justin? Oh, maybe you're all worn out? I don't know. It's really starting to seem like there's no end to this wall. What's the matter, Justin? It's not like you to suddenly sound so pessimistic. It's just that we started climbing such a long time ago. When will we finally get over it? Well, good question, but... Anyway, who was it who first said that we should climb this huge wall? Well, you? Why not just go back? We've had a heck of a climb to get this far. Justin, have you forgotten? Adventures never give up. That's what you told us. Or were you just making that up? Uh, no, I wasn't making it up. What I said is true, but... I was thinking I'd never make it to a place like this if I hadn't met you. I guess I'd forgotten what fun adventuring is... What fun adventuring is and what true adventures are all about. Justin, thank you. F Fina? 
you're right, you're right! We're adventurers! You betcha! If we pull our strength, then no, we can get over this wall. Okay, let's do it! Just you wait, Liette. We're gonna get to a lead for sure. Hey, look, Justin. Sue, the sky's full of beautiful stars. Oh, yeah, awesome! I'm sure it's just a little further to the, to the top. Come on, everyone. We can do it. Yeah, don't lose faith, Justin! Don't lose faith, buddy! I believe in you! It's gonna be hilarious if it's like they're right at the top. Oh, the morning sun is shining. Until now, the wall was in the way and we didn't get sunshine until afternoon. You know what that means? You're right! This must be it! Okay, let's go see! Man, imagine giving up literally right at the top. Can you imagine that? Oh man, look at that. Is that a crane? Oh. How about that? It's not really the end of the world. Look, the sun's rising. Awesome. It makes the world shine like gold, huh, Justin? Aw, no, they did it again. They cut off the music awkward awkwardly. Don't do that. Huh? What's that? Yeah, what is it? It's moving. Ah, oh, man, it was so cool that they just let the music go. Ah, oh, it just stopped so awkwardly. It was such a good moment. Yeah, I'm definitely getting some mega chills as well. Like, the game has barely even started for me. We're only like 12 hours in, but still it felt like such an awesome journey to get here, you know? But it feels like the game is really just beginning. Well, we've reached the top. Now how are we supposed to get down the other side? Uh, I don't see anything we can use to help us get down. We can't just scale down the wall either. Maybe if you just take a little push. Push push her off. There, she'll get to the other side. How many discs is Grandia to? I, I get the feeling like I need to sneeze, sneeze all the time. Can't believe this game is over, almost over, right? <laughs> if the game was only 14 hours long, man, that'd be a huge disappointment. See, to, to me, to my modern game sense, you know, like, well, not even modern game, like, comparatively to other games of its era, this game would be incredibly short if this was the end. I'm only level 12. <laughs> Justin, look! Ah! What? Oh, oh, okay, she just got picked up by the head. Ah, what are you doing? Uh, uh, Sue? You, you, what are you doing to Sue? Whoa! Justin! Oh, so where'd she go? I can't see her! Justin! Hey, stop it! Let go of me! Stop it now! Hey, you! Let's let go! I said let go! Oh, hold it right there! Take it back! I said earlier, don't let go! Okay, beat him! What should we do? You're asking me? Just do something, Justin! I was supposed to do that. I wanted to do that. And now I messed it up. I it, see the thing. I was just gonna give up on it working, but then it activated it somehow. So let me check to make sure this is right. Oh, I just turned off alerts. Whoops. Uh, it needs to be that. I 
Okay. No, they're back on. Uh, Justin. Oh. Oh. Hey, what's up, Wells? Yeah, they can't all be meant to perfect timing Mentos moments. I tried on that one. Messed it up a little bit. Damn. I'm still perfecting it. One day, guys. One day. Listen, the first time we did the Skyrim one, it was perfect. Uh, Justin. Justin, are you okay? Are you hurt anywhere? What do you mean, Fina? I'm fine. Slept like a baby. Justin. Wow. Whoa. I mean, okay. Ah! What's the matter, Fina? What's going on? Ha! Huh. Oh, what a relief. I was wondering what I'd do if you died right then. Ah. Oh. Now I remember. We fell from the top of the end of the world. Are you okay, Fina? Sure, I'm fine. Still a little dizzy, maybe. What well, saved us from getting hurt? Guess we looked out and fell onto this big leaf. What do you think? Wow, is this a leaf? It's humongous, isn't it? Still, I wonder how. Justin, look over there. I mean, what about Sue? Like, did they just drop us and like hope that we would live? Like, I don't, I don't think a leaf, no matter how big, would 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 drop your, would just, you know, you'd just be fine. Like, you, you're dead. You know. I was kind of thinking that maybe like they would have dropped me into like a safety chute or something. That would have been fine, but I don't know. Hey, it looks like it's true. We've crossed the end of the world, all right. What an amazing place this is. It looks like it's made for adventuring. Huh? Wait a second. Oh yeah, Sue, where's Sue? I haven't seen her yet. We got separated when we fell, but I'm sure she must be close by. Let's go find her. Right, I'm sure we can find her. Let's go, Fina. All right, we got the didgeridoo going on. Oh, those guys look friendly. Yeah, exactly, terminal velocity. Term terminal velocity just means that there's a maximum speed that you will eventually achieve while falling. But like, I mean, <laughs> You ain't you ain't living through that usually, you know. <laughs> oh, they are friendly. Yeah, nine point eight meters per second squared, right? I mean, people have survived falling terminal velocity, that's true. I'm just saying that, like, hitting a leaf is not going to do you much good in, in surviving that. <laughs> oh, hi. Wow. Wow. Ah, it was grown using Brondo. That makes sense. Wow. Wow. Wow, Rage Sun. Wow. Burnout! Yeah, I was definitely like super spooked oh, out in this part of the game. Not really like spooky, spooky, but just like hesitant and on my on my toes. Anyway, I 
That is not the spell that I wanted to cast. Yeah, I know. Please we can finally have some alone us. time. That's a little too far. Plop Mold, what a name. You put a period between uh, two letters, so Twitch thinks that's a link, and thus you get purged when I have link protection on. For me, I got into MMOs when World of Warcraft came out, so that was like PS2 era. And I got, that's why, that's why a lot of the games on the Variety Night list are PS2 games and a little bit of PS3 games. Like the vast majority of the games on that list are from that era. Like take a look at the list, I bet you anything. Especially the ones that I haven't ever played. They're almost all, almost entirely PS2 games. It's just too strong. I, I played WoW Classic for like a little bit of time to see if, you know, I'd enjoy it. I got to level 58, got bored, and stopped. It was a nice little trip down, down Nostalgia Lane, but I kind of want to raid, but like not really, and wasting all that time grinding and preparing for it just to do something I did already 15 years ago. I'm not really into it. It was a fun little thing. Sub for one month, got to play it, did it all over again. I guess technically PSO was my first MMO, I suppose, but I don't really consider that like the first. Actually, no, you know what? My first MMO was Tibia, which is like a 16-bit isometric R uh, German RPG MMO thingy. That was, uh, that was... I, I got to like level 80 in that game, dude. I had, I had a paladin. I would sit there and farm giant spiders all day and level up and sell night armors and stuff. That was like what I did every day. Oops, I lagged, I'm dead. Lost five levels, a week's worth of playing the game. All right, we won. Dun -dun 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 -dun. That game was insanely brutal. Like, I, th I think because I played Tibia so much, it's probably why I don't get like upset when I when I play games like Dark Souls and I die. I'm just like, all right, whatever. I can just go back and try it again, you know? Oh, nice, Wells. Nice, dude. 
9999 on the sky of five. I see your journey has just begun. I never played Rootscape. Never, ever even downloaded it. I barely know what it even looks like. I have zero experience with Rootscape. But yeah, I, I, uh, I gave up Tibia completely when World of Warcraft came out. My friend wanted me to play. I got a copy, I finally got a computer that can play. I wanted to play FF11, but I didn't have a computer that could play it. What's up, Danzel? Going good, how you doing? I don't think I had a PS2 at the time. I'm trying to remember. I'm pretty sure I couldn't afford a PS2 at the time. I'm pretty sure. What a thing. Oh my god. Yeah, basically, Danzel. Thank you for the... <laughs> Thank you for the 333 bits. Yeah, lots of sidekick and essentially. There's a lot of repetitious abilities in this one, for sure. I'm pretty sure at the time that uh, WoW came out, uh, I was... <clears throat> I want to say it was... How late? How late in... Well, no, no, no. I'm not... not, not... WoW, but... Uh... FF11. Gosh, I'm, I'm, I wasn't able to get a PS2 until a few years after it came out. Oh, same. That's why. That's why it's an alert because it was such a meme here. All I did was spam sidekick on Star Ocean 3. I, I, I wanted. To, so what happened was I was working at uh, Sears as a sales, as like a uh, sales and electronics department, and. Someone traded in their PS2 there, and what a thing. they had like a bunch of games, controllers, and everything, and we didn't really have like pricing for that, but we, we didn't have a rule against trading it in or something for store credit. It was really weird. So we just had this PS2, used PS2 in a bag, like a plastic bag, like we didn't know what to do with it. It was like 20 bucks or something like that. It was like some sports junkie dude that had it So it was likely gonna be busted and not work or whatever because it was all grody and whatever um, I I Gambled with it I gambled with it And it lasted me five years especially considering that ps2s have a 33% defective rate It was a huge gamble So I gambled with it Turned out to last me, turned out to last me five years, and uh, I cleaned it up, of course, and everything, and served me well. But my my fat PS2 is shoot dead now. I, I, I it's, it's super dead. I am I, I believe if I get into another battle, the game's gonna freeze because it had like a weird little audio snippet glitchy thingy at the end there. That tends to be like a telling point so I'm going to try and hoof it back to the save point but yeah like my ps2 that, that ps2 that I got lasted just long enough for the ps mini to come out the ps2 mini that uh, had just come out when my ps2 stopped working so I was like oh hey cool I'll just get this the mini See you later, Wells. Yeah, the the original fat PS2s almost had a had a, like a one in three defective rate on launch. They were really poorly constructed, really really poorly made. Which is funny because nowadays, if a console came out like that, they just like receive so much flack from social media and stuff. Thoughts on PS5? Cool. It can't, it, uh, geez. 
It's coming out a little sooner than I expected, but not by much. I expected an eight-year gap between PS3 and PS... Sorry, PS4 and PS5. And it's looking to be like a... Seven-year gap, I think. What games do we get? Who knows, man? Who knows what games we're gonna get with PS5? No freaking idea. We're gonna get video games, though. That's for sure. No, they've already confirmed all of the FF7 remake will be available on PS4. But it's also backwards compatible. Uh, so it doesn't matter that much. But the reason, the reason it'll be backwards compatible is because it uses the same framework and basically it's just a more powerful PS5 or all PS4. Right, we won. The PS5 will just be a more powerful PS4. And that's why it's backwards compatible, because it's just playing the same format of disc. It doesn't matter. It's it's interchangeable completely. It'll just use the same hardware, which is really nice. It's like PlayStations are pretty much just becoming co uh, P little PCs now to the point where they even have operating software and operating systems rather. And, and you know, they just kind of play what the game, whatever. So backwards compatibility is very easy. Uh, as far as backwards compatibility beyond PS4, I doubt it. They won't be compatible with PS3, 2, or 1, more than likely. Which I don't really care about too much. Burnout. Did they confirm that it'll be backwards compatible all the way to PS1? Without emulation? Without emulation. That's the important one right there. Because I don't, I, I, if it's emulation, it doesn't count. <laughs> Pretty easy. If it's emulated, then it's not going to be super great. Uh, likely going to be new bugs per game on a, on a per game basis that we'll, we'll have to find out on our, on our, as we play games. And it won't be as true to form, so not really worried about it. I mean, I have a PS2 to play my PS1 and PS2 games with original hardware. Oh, neat. I almost didn't see that. And I uh, got a PS3 for PS3 games. If if it did play PS3 games with hardware, I'd be I'd, I, I think that's within reason to do that, since they're like, what, DVD discs or, or something like that? Still, which is really easy for that to... Uh, for them to do that. But yeah. Wow. Yeah, I know PS3 emulated PS1 already, and it's shit. <laughs> it's absolute shit. Same with PS2 games. There's all sorts of unique PS3 bugs with PS1 and PS2 games. There's actually documents. There's actually documents detailing every game's unique bugs based on playing it emulated on PS3. PS3 uses Blu-ray? Maybe. Not bad, eh? You ever watch Krayson VG? He he when his Grand JRPG tour, he was playing a lot of PS2 games on his PS3. I, I actually got him a PS2 to help him along with his his tour and everything as a gift. That was one of my gifts to him. Uh, but like before that happened, he would have so many bugs with random games here and there playing PS2 games on PS3. Oh, owie. And uh, there and that's how I found out about all the the. The bullshit with that going on there. Wow, that's a lot of enemies. There's gotta be some stuff over there. Let's go down here first a little bit just to see. Wow, there's a lot of enemies. PS3 had really strange trip chip build-ins and a really strange CPU, which is why backwards compatibility for PS3 games is more than unlikely. Well, that's too bad. 